Even though the Ministry of Education has implemented a consolidated curriculum for teaching, Minister of Education Prey Manik Chan on Monday revealed that a complete revision of teaching methods is needed to help students recover from learning loss. The Education Minister made these comments after questions were asked about bridging the gap between grade 6 pupils who are now back in the classroom after missing months of teaching and students who have been continuously taught. Are we looking at how we go in? Are we going to go back in and teach as though these two years we were not out? And the answer is no. When you go back in, you have to do the year before work. And the teacher only moves up as the children become competent in that year, um, year's work. And so you're going to, it, ha, it has to be a complete revision of what we have become accustomed to. The completion of syllabus and um, curricula and so on has to be based on how children are responding to that and so that's what we're trying to get over to teachers. Over 900 of the 1300 children who were found to be absent from school are now back in classrooms following the government's successful operation recovery. Minister Manik Chan said a range of issues were also unearthed for the pupils absenteeism. So we saw reasons ranging from poverty to um, carelessness to extremes. We saw children not coming out because they were babysitting other younger siblings. These are 10 and 11 year olds doing the babysitting. We saw persons who did not even know that there were exams or that they were, this is, there was this assessment. We saw children who had been out so long that they, they were heading towards being, being dropouts. Um, so a range of issues. According to the minister, children were out of school for so long that they were on the verge of being dropouts. And while the ministry has been providing support for these children, Manik Chan also urged teachers, schools and education departments to be more conscious when children are absent for long periods. Meanwhile, Operation Recovery will be a prolonged exercise, and while it started with grade 6 pupils, once schools fully reopen on April 25th, all grades will be assessed to find absent children. Reporting for the Newsroom, I am Isanella Pato.